Hey guys, here's a video to enable side loading on BYD Addo 3 Global Version cars. This is a clean system after making factory reset, and I am trying to downgrade to enable side loading. Unfortunately the BYD is trying to restrict this feature, and now the global cars are fully restricted. This is what you will get if your USB is not supported or has incorrect formatting. For me worked only MS-DOS USB formatting instead of FAT32. What you need is copy of firmware to formatted USB and restart your infotainment in a fast boot mode by holding volume and left arrow on a steering wheel. This is an old downgraded version with old UI. Let's check a version and make a proof. Let's see am I able to enable USB debug mode here. Great, I will enable it for better experience. So while you're on this firmware, you should unlock third-party app installation. Copy to USB necessary files into third-party apps folder and insert into USB port. You will be asked for a password. Enter GHY0613 bid, and then you will be able allowed to install them. After installing wireless ADB switch, you will get one more feature and you will be able to connect with a car wirelessly. I decided to manually upgrade to a newer version since I already had this firmware ready to install. Just plug in your USB or SSD, I prefer SSD, and the installation process will begin. Now feel free to remove the USB. This is a newer version from 2025. Now you can see the USB debug mode is hidden, but that is not a problem as we have unlocked the system previously. With this app you can change the region to China, Brazil or Greece, and after restart get the settings back. You can also change this region later back to your country. Okay, let's check can I download the latest update by OTA, which means over the air. And yes, the package has been downloaded. This is the same 2505 version that I had before downgrading, and suddenly I got a black screen. But don't worry. Restart your car, and everything will be back. I want to thank the unofficial BYD community for striving to make our driving experience not only more exciting, but also safer, despite the EU's restrictive regulations on our vehicles and BYD's own policies, which aim to give us as little as possible.